Warriors in the LFA, a lightweight division. And do not blink in this one. I think we have our classic wrestler versus striker, but obviously nowadays you have to have both. Beautiful single leg takedown by Garcia on the guillotine already. Wow, quick transition, and he captures the neck of Contwamba, and he's he's got it in there tight. Yeah, Contwamba did a great job of jumping over to the side mount position, but he's still in this guillotine right here. Let's see if Garcia can use this as a sweep if he doesn't get the submission. And let's see if Katamboy can pull his head out. Garcia told us he really wanted to blend his boxing and wrestling, get inside and, and score a takedown. And, and now the power of Cedric Katamboy powers out of it. Well, he did a really go good job. Garcia did a great job immediately of mixing his striking to the takedown. But along the way, he was reversed. Oh, and a quick oh, stoppage. A very quick stoppage. And there might be an injury. Yes, Adam Garcia is in a lot of pain. Maybe a broken rib. A Joe Coca, our referee, came in quickly. He saw something, and you can see on the face of Adam Garcia that he is in a lot of pain, rubbing his chest. And kudos to our referee, Joe Coca. Cedric Katamba oh, just it. put his knee maybe on the belly, slid to the mountain position, was going to be in a very superior uh, position already. Uh, Might have broke his rib along the way. Oh, my uh, goodness. Look at the pain Garcia is in. He is in a lot of pain. There's no oh, doubt about it. it. Yeah, a lot of props to Cedric. You know, these things happen in the sport right here. You know, we don't want to take nothing away for, for Katamba. He was, he was on his way to victory, I believe, regardless. A fast start from Cedric Katambwa. As we take a look, we're not sure if we can see exactly what happened. That's... Here he is moving to the mount position. Right. Pushes him down, starts punching, elbow after elbow. He starts tapping here. And maybe it, it didn't even look, and I, I'm not a doctor, I'm not going to speculate, but it didn't look like there was anything that Katamba did, Gil. Maybe it was just how he moved, or I think it was just the straining of Garcia to try to get out of get that out. that horrible position. He was stuck, and he tried to buck and use all his energy, and probably popped a rib at the same time yeah. with with Katamba on top. With Katamba was a brick out there, and you know, and oh, this was this was shaping up right here to be a good fight. I wanted to see if Garcia can weather that storm, but Katamba was in a very superior position. Oh, and good to see that Adam Garcia is at least up on the stool now, but he is in oh. he is in severe pain. Oh. You, you know, I, I've it. just torn the intercostal muscle, just the muscle between my ribs, yeah. and I thought my rib was broken, and, and I, it is the most painful thing. I can imagine a broken rib. It looks like we have a broken rib here. I mean, that, that looks like the face of a broken rib right now. Yeah having a hard time breathing. Uh, it fucking hurts to breathe. Uh. It was, no, it was when he was mounting and I felt yeah, it start crunching. Yeah, I, uh, I have a feeling it might be sublux. This is a common area where the rib can, it can uh, pop out. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Gil, let's take another look at when he has the guillotine and goes down. And this is where Katamba takes. Yeah, maybe the shoulder pressure. Katamba did a great yeah. job of neutralizing the guillotine. When someone pulls guard on the guillotine, you try to jump to the opposite side of your head, to the side mount. He did that. And here's Garcia still trying to work this choke. But you can see Katamba pulling his head out. Katamba pulling his head out and pushing the knee down, trying to advance to the mount position here. We just heard Garcia right now say, hey, when he was on the mount, I started right. feeling the crunching. I started hearing the crunching. And, and again, the knee on the belly hurts. If anyone grapples right. or anyone fights, you know, Tito Ortiz would always put the knee on the belly. When I put the knee on the belly, it forces uh, your opponent to, to react, and it's painful. People tap to the knee on the belly. Here's the pressure. 
Garcia holding on tight. Katamba with the vicious elbows. Just the strain. I'm just assuming it's the strain of Garcia. The strain of Garcia trying to get out and what a bummer. Beautiful sign of respect from yes. Cedric Tambwa, who goes over and then shakes the hand of Adam Garcia. We hope that Garcia is okay and is able to bounce back. Uh, just in a lot of pain right now. And um, good to see him on his feet, though. All right. Let's now get the official time back inside to Mike Kendall. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee Joe Coca calls a stop to this fight in 58 seconds of the very first round, declaring a winner by TKO, Cedric Gautama. Well, not the way that he had hoped to win it, but